developing story also in the North County. Three kids rushed to the hospital overdosing on Xanax. Our tenders reporter Rachel Bianco is live at the police department in Carmel Valley and, and Rachel police are now looking for more victims. This is a big problem. Yeah, that's right, Steve. Police here are still trying to figure out where the kids got the Xanax. But while they do that, they sent out this alert because they want parents to know what's going on in case their kids start showing symptoms. It's a popular prescription used to treat anxiety. Xanax is one of the most overprescribed drugs out there. And so it's in many, many medicine cabinets. And I don't know that everybody's aware of how highly addictive that is. Or how dangerous. Police say three Carmel Valley area teenagers learned that the hard way Thursday. They were taken to the hospital after overdosing. Depending on, on weight, depending on uh, a lot of different factors, uh, where is the overdose point? The overdose point is when they lose consciousness. Nancy Knott is a licensed marriage and family therapist. Addiction is one of her specialties. She doesn't know the kids involved in this case, but she says parents should know the warning signs. What you'd be seeing is, is more of a depressed affect, uh, more of a going to sleep type of affect. Uh, again, it's a, it's, it's a downer. Cole Chatteroy is a junior at Torrey Pines High School. He says Xanax is not big at his school. Yeah, as far as I know, it's not the new up and coming thing. You think this could just have been like a fluke? Or? I think so. I think that some kids just got their hands on it and they just went wild. This is a nationwide problem and it's a community problem. We don't know what school the kids go to. Police aren't releasing any information about their ages or how they're doing. We'll give you more information as soon as police release it. Reporting live in Carmel Valley, Rachel Bianco, 10 News.